guys, today I'm going to be doing a makeup video and today I have the assistance of Piper May. She also has a channel, channel. I definitely recommend it. So make sure to click that subscribe button. Okay guys, so now we're gonna start out with some foundation. We're gonna put it all over my face. <laughs> it is so much more fun guys to do it with your friends than by yourself. You should totally try it uh, with your friends. Uh, Piper May has really good makeup videos. She, her makeup always looks beautiful. And so I think you should watch her videos. They're so amazing. Okay guys, so once you have your foundation done and it's very beautifully blended, in which I really much like it, um, now what you're going to want to do next, put on some natural looking blush. I use L'Oreal Paris, a true match blush, and it's very beautiful. Um, it's very peachy, and Piper is going to use that. We're using um, a, a Beauty Accents brush, a total face brush. Uh, you can use it for everything. I just use it for my fun. Actually, we use this sponge for my foundation. Super soft, pretty, and I got these cosmetic sponges from Glam and Beauty. You just do it like that. It's so soft. Remember to make sure. Remember to keep um, all your blush right on the cheekbone. Just right up on top. You wanna make sure it stays right here in this zone. And you can get a little bit like up here, like that. And that's kind of how you want to do your blush. Not exactly how I do my blush every single day. You also want to make it and put a little bit on your nose. My cousin and my friend Piper May has taught me this because it makes your nose look really pretty and it makes your face pop and it makes it beautiful. So what we're going to want to do next is use some uh, rainbow highlighter. I call it my unicorn highlighter. Um, yeah, it's called where I'm using wet and wild. So it's all different colors and we're going to use it. So what you want to do with the highlighter is put it over the brush. So you want it to be right here, right here on your face. So you want it to be a little bit above the blush and make sure not to put very much on like that. Make sure to keep it above the blush. Just like that. And now it's getting shiny. We'll have to show you it in the light after this is completely done. So um, I'll have a bathroom light and it, it makes it very, seeable what we're gonna do next is do some eyeshadow with i have an entire pack of brushes and we're gonna be using this bronzer next uh and then we'll do the eyeshadow so we're gonna be using this brush it's super fluffy nice beautiful so we're gonna be using this we want to apply this all over our face to make it look very defined We want you to just kind of do a circle motions all around your face. Very fast, nice little motions. Now you do it on the next side. Now you do it on the forehead. And I think we're all done with that. So now what you want to do is to take some um, powder like this one. It will usually come with this little pad thingy and you can like use that. So we're gonna be using that. And then after you use that, it'll look a little crazy looking. It'll make your face white. So you're gonna to wanna to blend that. And make sure not to use too much because it'll make your face very weird looking. Piper is very good at powder, I know that. And I've never had Piper do my makeup before, so I'm very excited to see how this turns out. I don't have much light in my room because one is like not working. So I'm excited to redo my room, guys. So that's gonna be happening soon. I forgot to tell you about that. I'm gonna redo my room. So you gotta blend this really good after you get that um, pad all over your face with the um, powder. Yes, so now that's how it looks. 
I'll have to show you in the light when it's all completely done. Now what we want to do next is some eyeshadow. It's very nice. So the first color we're going to do, we're all actually going to do it in the crease, which is this part of your eye where it gets a little dent. So you're going to use, you're going to want to use this color right here. So now we're going to use this color. And then we're going to put that in the crease. You want it to make it look very defined, beautiful. You want it to make your eyes pop. Watch the James Charles palette on Piper May's video. Super beautiful. It gets really pretty. If you could see this guys, I wish you could because it's so beautiful. I know I've said this many times, but you're gonna see it at the end results at the, at the end of the video. We're gonna go and get some light in the bathroom. Now what we wanna do on the lids, we actually wanna do this very goldy color. Um, this one right here. That one, it's very shiny. So now we're gonna put this on the lid, the lid part. Gorgeous. So now once you've had that done, um, the next thing you want to do is lips. So the color I'm going to be using, I want to do a natural color. So let me check out my colors. Um, so the color I think I want to do is this very peachy creamy color. I don't want I don't want to do it like super like just use it. I want it to do it lightly and to make it pretty. Just putting um on a brush um and you're gonna outline your lips with that. where to go on your lips from where to go. Okay. So now once you have that done, you want it to look very peachy and natural, which it definitely does. I think I'm looking really good so far. Piper has done an amazing job. So now what you want to do the last final thing is to do your eyebrows. So guys, I don't have any cool eyebrow stuff, which I really would like some, but this is what I have. I like to use the bronzer, so I'm gonna use like the, one of the darker part, the palettes of it. So what she's gonna do is use this, and then she's gonna do my eyebrows with the um, eyebrow brush, and then she's gonna, kind of, and that's kinda of gonna blend it and make it look, my eyebrows look a little bit more natural. Okay guys, so once you have that done, now it's time to brush it out. You don't use this part, because that's for mascara and getting the clumps out. This part is for using the eyebrow thing. Okay guys, so I think it looks really good. So after that, I think you're pretty much good. All you have to do now is spray yourself with some fresh, very nice feeling perfume, which I have white jasmine from Bath and Body Works. So now once you have that done, you're completely done. So now I'm gonna show you what it looks like in the light. All right, bye guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, remember, I didn't do this beautiful makeup. Piper May did. So I hope you watch her channel. Um, it's called Piper May. Um, she's got some amazing makeup videos. Uh, I'll see you next time, guys. Bye.